All right, guys, I'm back. I'm super sorry if I worried you guys, but actually I was moving houses and I had to get internet. I had to get all this other extra stuff so I could start recording. But yeah, now I'm finally back. So thanks everyone for supporting me and all that. Everyone that was waiting for my videos. I'm super sorry that I didn't upload. Let's get right into the video, guys. <laughs> All right, guys, so welcome back to another video on All Star. So, yeah, guys, finally, I'm back, and uh, we're going to go ahead and try to create the Attack on Titan team. Now, since they added a new unit, which is the Warhammer Titan, into the game, which is from Raid 2, pretty much with this, the like, All Star allows us to create, like, you know, a decent Attack on Titan team with some, just some few units, like, for example, the Warhammer Titan, of course, Eren, Erwin, and then Levi. Where's Levi at? There you go. Okay, so this is four-star Levi. So pretty much we got four Attack on Titan characters that are, like, actual characters, not gold units. And I do have a gold unit on me that could pretty much be good for, like, this spot. But then I'm missing a heal unit. Now, to make this team a better, like team like more attack on titan i'm gonna equip this unit right here this gold unit i'm gonna unequip boma no boma this time guys because i want as much attack on titan units as possible and i'm gonna have six star frieza chilling in the back and assisting us actually no i'm gonna have ace instead because ace is weaker than frieza so ace is just perfect for taking out pretty much like air units but anything other than that not really because i want my attack on titan units to be handling that stuff so I mean, all right, I guess this is the team, guys. I got Ace for the, you know, heal units and stuff. I got these dudes, and I don't know which map to pick. I might just pick, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna go with the Fairy Tale map, because the Fairy Tale map is a pretty long map, and I feel like this map would be perfect for, like, Eren and stuff like that, especially buffing, too. Yeah, this one might actually be good. Now, we all know that Bone was pretty much, like, an essential unit in the game, but I don't have a Boma on me. So what I'm gonna place that can I can this game load in bro? Okay, so what I was trying to say is like what I'm gonna place down first. I'm probably gonna place down um an Aaron first, but what I need to do is I also need to check where I'm gonna set up. So I got my boy Levi here with me. I don't know like how good he is because I barely used him before, but all I know is that this guy does some bleed damage, so that's good. Then I got this time with me, which I know is not really great. Then I got uh this dude, Aaron. Um I don't know how to do this setup. I think I might just do this setup like right over where should i do it probably like around the curve right here yeah i might just do it right here honestly or should i do it up front actually i might just do it up front yeah i'm gonna do it up front so i'm gonna do my whole entire setup right here since i have erwin on me because with erwin like i could do the infinite buff strat which is really really op and especially with like these units any unit basically becomes op with the erwin strat so yeah and like i said guys gonna have a ace in the back now uh where should i have the ace should i have it right over here or should i have my ace over here i think it would be a better idea to have them like over here instead because like they might not have enough time to actually kill any of the air units if they get to this point so i'm just gonna place my aces like right over here so the attack on titan team now also uh same thing with jojo i could also make a jojo team so if you guys want me to make a jojo team let me know in the comment section below let's see how much of a clown units they are I mean, they're pretty useful with the time stops and all that, but like in terms of damage and stuff like that, you know. And of course, you know, My Hero Academia, I already made a video on using that team. And My Hero Academia units are honestly just so bad. They haven't even got a new unit in a while. So same thing with Jojo as well. Now, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'm really disappointed in this unit. Just the fact that it is okay. It is a free unit, but my God, you know, level 60. By the time you're level 60, you're going to have good units. So honestly, well, let me turn on um, auto skip because I like auto skip a lot. It's just so helpful. Like it makes everything so much faster. And before I start upgrading anything, I need to upgrade this ace because this guy's range does not reach the road because I put him over here, which is a fat L. We got the armor Titan versus the Warhammer Titan guys. Let's see who will win. Okay, let's go. All right, looks like the Warhammer Titan won. I still need a bit of money to upgrade this. Okay, just a little bit more, just a little bit more. Come on, there we go. Okay, finally. All right, that was such a bad location to place this character. Why did I place him right here? I should have placed him right here, man. What was I thinking? All right, whatever. I guess um, Ace will be helping a little bit less, but as long as he hits the air units at least once or twice, that's good, I guess. So I'm definitely not going to upgrade this guy. I'm going to place down a... Uh, where should I place my errands? I'm going to place my errands in a line like right over here because I'm going to have this whole entire line just buffing my Warhammer Titans, my Levi's, and my errands as well. Not going to lie to you guys, Eren is pretty powerful if he's buffed by Erwin. He goes up to like, I think it's 14k damage which is actually pretty good 
I think that might actually get me to wave 40. I'm have I don't have high hopes for this team. I'm not gonna lie because this team is just not looking great. Like to be honest, like Levi, come on, man, Levi is. I mean, he's the goat in the anime, but in this game. He's a different story, but his attack is nice though. I can't lie. All right, so I got 1.9K. I might just upgrade this area in a bit. There we go. And now I'm out of money, but I could probably place, oh, I could place on another unit. I might place down a, war I don't know. I'm not gonna place a Warhammer there. I think this should be the limit to where I place stuff. And then from here to here to the Warhammer Titan, this is where I'm gonna have all my units, literally. That's how I'm gonna have to do this setup because Eh, yeah, that's how I'm gonna do it. Like, that's how it's gonna go. Or I might just upgrade this. There you go. Yeah, upgrade this. Get that spike harding. But then, basically, the AoE for this character will be way better on, like, a road like this than in a corner because of how the AoE changes to, like, a more of, like, a slim, long one. What am I... Yo, someone could take that out of context so bad. Heck no. So, I got my Aaron coming in. Let's go. We got the Killer Giant with 2.5k HP, finally. I'm still at only wave 9. Like, how am I doing this, man? It's like it's like been forever. So got my Aaron maxed out. I'm gonna I'm not gonna max this guy out yet. He can chill with his huge AoE for now. But you know what? I'm gonna pop down the main man that will carry this team. Not gonna lie to you guys, this this character looking pretty fire. Look at that man. Jeez, this character is pretty good. Like look at that. 15 damage every five seconds, 18 range, and it's single target. Come on, bro. Like what's gonna beat this? And he's maxed upgrade is 23 damage every five seconds. Oh, it applies bleed? I never knew these units apply bleed. Okay, that's pretty cool, I guess. I think I might actually just upgrade this Warhammer Titan real quick. Let me just do that. Because just might as well just get out the way. And then after that, I'll just set up like two Irwins. And then after that, I'll set up like two more. And I could do the infinite Irwin buff. Alright, there you go. This is his... Uh... Oh, I thought his uh, AoE was like slim. But it's actually not. It's actually pretty good. Let me turn my graphics all the way up. There you go. Attack effects. Now I can see everything attacking at the same time. There we go. Let me see that spike. Okay, I guess the game is going okay so far. The air units are about to come in, so hopefully this ace can take it out. I might have to place another ace right here, honestly, because I messed that up so badly. Yeah, there you go. I guess I'll place on the ace right there, and that's pretty much enough. All right, let's go ahead and start placing down a uh, Erwin real quick. I guess I'll place it, like, right over here. Upgrade, and then I'll place another one once I get enough money. All right, here we go. I could probably do the first upgrade. Well... Not upgrade, but buff. And there, oh my god, look at this character now. Not gonna lie, the Warhammer Titan might be the like basically Warhammer and uh, Eren is gonna be the ones like carrying this team and Erwin pretty much. These three units are gonna be the ones carrying the team. I don't know about the Levi though. All right, so let me set some priorities real quick. So I'm gonna set the Hammer Giant Titan or Warhammer Titan, whatever his priority to last. I'm gonna set this guy's priority to first because I don't really care. And this guy can stay to first because honestly, it's a bleed unit. I mean, actually, I'm gonna set it to strongest because it's a bleed unit. So I have to set him to strongest. And then this guy, honestly, I'm just gonna leave him be. He could do whatever he wants. All right, let me try buying some more Irwins real quick. So right over here, place it there. And then another one right over here. Okay, there we go. So now I just gotta upgrade these and I'm pretty much done with getting all my Irwins down I could just keep buffing and buffing but I feel like we're kind of fine for now so I'm not gonna do the buffs yet okay there we go finally upgrade now there we go okay uh yeah I'm not doing buffs yet so pretty much I'm gonna place down another Warhammer Titan I could probably place it like right over here because the buff is in it like they could buff like yeah they could definitely buff it all right I'm gonna place it right there upgrade this one as well set it to last two I wonder what kind of other Attack on Titan characters they would add into this game. I know for a fact a lot of people are waiting for like the adult Eren, like Founding Titan Eren, but they're not going to add that because like that's that's basically really far away in the anime and there's no way that they're going to spoil a bunch of people because some people are waiting for the anime. They don't want to read the manga, right? So that we're definitely not going to get Founding Titan Eren for a while. But I mean, anything other than that, I could definitely see some things happening. Like I would love to see a Beast Titan for sure. That would be amazing. Honestly, if I think about it, like the Beast Titan could be a unit that could literally compete against Mihawk because we saw in the anime and in the manga, if you're a manga reader only, like we saw that how far can th this guy can literally throw. Like he is cracked at throwing rocks, my guy. So, I mean, look, if we had the Beast Titan, I could definitely see him being, uh, you know, a thing that you could compete with Mihawk for sure. Like he has to have at least 100 range. There's no way. If they had in the Beast Titan with 100 range and it's not a kill unit, I'm telling you, the devs are on something. That's it. That's all I'm going to say. 
All right, you know what? I'm going to max out my Levi because this guy's been chilling here, not even maxed out. And everything else is just getting maxed out before him. So guess I'll do that real quick. Oh, yeah. And I also have to make sure that I have to place down all my Aaron's because if I don't, I'm selling the game because Aaron is going to be like the biggest carry for this. So I might not even just spend my money on. Yeah, I'm leaving Levi like that. I'm not even touching this dude again. I'm going to touch him later. Whoa, pause. All right, so I placed all eight down, but now I need to upgrade them. But man, money is an issue. Money is an issue in this game. I literally can't upgrade anything. I'm just out of money right now. 294. What am I supposed to do with this? Oh, yeah, I'm going to place down another giant too because this character is cracked. Finally, the errands made it, man. It took a while for them to make it. But I'm pretty sure by the time they reach the spawn over there, another set is going to spawn in because this map is so long. Yeah, so guys, I decided to start buffing because honestly, I'm at wave 24 and I barely got any units down. And I mean, honestly, like these sets of units that I have down are not really the strongest, especially this guy. I mean, it attacks every five seconds. He's definitely one of the strongest on the team, like I said. But I just got to get back into buffing because it's just not going to be looking good if I don't, especially at wave this wave I'm at right now. Everything's definitely going to get stronger in like a few waves. All right, so the triple buff is finally uh, like applied to like three maxed out titans. So now I'm getting 14k HP titans coming in, which is amazing. But I mean, the, even the ones that are not maxed out, they got 1.2k HP, which is still pretty good. And I got to rebuff real quick before this thing runs out. There we go. I think I could already max it. Yeah, I can max this one. All right, now I got four maxed out. I got to make sure that my aces are also able to handle the, uh, the stuff that are going to be coming in. I have to set this to strongest. I'm going to set this to first so that that way the one in the front is always getting targeted and the other ones are all put on fire. Yo, I got a buff. I got a buff. Okay, there we go. I buffed. Okay, we good. We good. Hopefully these air units die. I'm at wave 29. I mean, it's not looking great, but I'm definitely surviving, kind of. Upgrade almost this thing to max. I'm almost maxed out on all my Irwins, or I mean Aaron's. I literally have seven bones. Nope, make that 102 bones left. Oh, no way. Did I actually reach wave 30 with this team? Did I do it? <laughs> Let's go wave 30. Okay, good, good, good. All right, one more Aaron left, and I got everything maxed out for Aaron's. And that's going to be my that's gonna be my trump card, my guy. Oh, so now that I got everything now maxed out, the next step is to place down more of these hammer titans because they're just so much better than everything else. Uh, but they cost so much. Oh, my goodness. It costs way too much. Oh, I got to rebuff real quick. Hold on. There we go. Got the buff. And I can't place it down. I don't have enough money. Oh, no. Stuff are going into the tower. Did I lose? Oh, my goodness. I almost lost. Whoa. Okay. I got to place down another ace. I Wait. Actually, I don't because at wave 34, there's no more that come in. No more hill units. Only at like wave 40 something. Wave 43 or 42, I believe. At that wave is when the air units start coming again. Guess I'll place down some Levi's now since uh, I'm maxed out on placing down Warhammer Titans. I'm going to place some more Levi's in the front because I want that bleed to maximize. There we go. And I'm also going to set all these Warhammer Titans to last since they got nice AOE cones. Now, like I said, I'm leaving my Levi's all on first or strongest. Doesn't really matter because this character attacks like barely. I mean, it's every five seconds, but it's just such low damage. that It's like barely anything. And I got a buff again. There we go. Let me do that real quick. I mean, look, guys, it's I mean, I'm not going to lie to you guys. This team is doing a lot better than I thought it would because I mean, look, like we don't really have much powerful units on us, but we're still chilling at wave 37. And I think that's because of Erwin, man. Erwin is really just like doing it for us, but not not yet. Look how much units are getting passed. Like these Titans got 14k HP. It takes like what? What? It takes like two units now to kill a Titan. Let me see this real quick. Yeah, these. Oh, it takes one, my guy. Snake Omaru, Orochimaru literally has 13k HP. That's literally almost 14k because he got 13k.8 or 800. So pretty much like that, that's one Titan down already. And I could spawn like what? Eight every 120 seconds. Yeah, I'm definitely losing, guys. There's no way I'm getting to 40. There is no way. I don't believe it. Hold on. Wait, what if I do this? What if I what if I start doing this tactic? Hold on. Let me let me delete one of these real quick. All right, I just want to get to 40 now, man. That's it. I'm not even going to care. Oh, shoot. I'm trying to place on the wrong unit. There we go. Okay. Get to 40 real quick. Yes, I'm, I'm doing this method, guys. Yeah, I'm doing this method. I don't know if this is going to work out, but I mean, it is what it is, man. You got to do what you got to do at this point just to get 40. 
I gotta make sure I rebuff too. Can't. Wow, I really just missed it by a split second. That is not it. That is definitely not it. I'm losing. I'm losing. Okay, wave 39. At this point, I just don't care about the buffs either. You know, everything can come. Just let me get to 40, man. Oh no, there's a cloner right there. There's a freaking cloner right there. That's not good. These these snake omarus are not dying. Even with Ace's help, which is like not supposed to even count because it's Ace. Not a <gasps> wave 40 though. I mean, look, these units didn't die, even though they were attacked by, you know, Ace. So, I mean, look, Ace wasn't that much of a help. He just helped out with the air units. But, look, I mean, I did get to wave 40. Let's go. With it, without, you know, Ace killing any of these units on the ground. So, I'm happy about that. And now I'm about to die. Okay, I guess it's a uh, game over, guys. Damn, GG. All right, well, anyway, guys, I'm going to have to end the video right there. Comment down below what you guys think of this team. And should I really do the JoJo team like I said I should? Uh, and yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all I got to say. And thanks so much for watching this video, guys. I really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, that was the all AOT team. Peace out.